got it. You got it. Okay. Hello. Hi. Hi, everyone. Good afternoon. It's me again, Cleopatra from AEI Wellness in coming well coming live to you from Kota Kinabalu Sabah and today I have here our Miss Dionysia Peter and say hi hi <laughs> us again hi hello <laughs> yeah hi again uh, she's always uh, she's one of our uh, frequent uh, sharer in AI wellness as well so we have lots of things to share today. And today our topic is about high vitality water. How to know this? Well, there are lots of things. Yes. Yeah. Sorry, yeah. Oh no, I said tune in. <laughs> Since um, water, uh, human body is made up. How many percent clear? 75 percent, right? 70, 70, yeah. What is 70 percent? Actually, there are five percent. There are few numbers I saw on the internet. Some say 60 percent, 70 percent, 80 percent is the highest so far. But I guess our blood is also mm -hmm. water liquid form. So I guess it's not just water, it's also blood, right? It's all yeah. in liquid form. So um, it's very, very important part of our life an important part of our body. So that's why we are talking about this today. Yay. Yes, very, very interesting. Um, something that, uh, you know, like we live with every day, but we tend to, you know, take it for granted um, just how much water can actually um, be affected with surroundings, with our emotions, practically with everything. And we can hopefully from our um, session today, we can actually impart some very in, um, useful facts to you about how water can help us to live better, to live, um, to live in um, holistic wellness, how it can support us in that particular journey. So tune in and um, please share, uh, please share around um, this video, I think. In Facebook, there are only a few people, so let us share. <laughs> yes. Yeah, let me, let me just go to my Facebook. I would like to share with my friends as well. Okay, friends yeah. on Facebook, if you are, I mean, you, you are watching us now, please share this post share. with all yes. your friends so that they can get some useful tips as well, how they can even, how they can have high vitality water at home and also for themselves when they go out okay uh we're gonna share that with you in a moment just let me share with my friends yes i am doing the same thing so let's just see let's see we are live just one minute uh -huh. What else I wonder? <laughs> um. Oh no. Okay, and then I mean, it just shows how how little friends I have on Facebook. <laughs> I know. It doesn't mean that you have a lot of friends. You are happy as long as you're happy. I think a uh, uh, a lot of those. I think I don't remember most of um, the the names on on my Facebook friend list. That's why. 
know, like you have to remember at least who, and most of them are our virtual friends anyway. So <laughs> it's like, uh, okay, who's there, who's not there? Uh, I, I'm just sharing to public groups uh, so that uh, more public. people can have access to our our video here. So just give me a few moments. Uh, I'm excited to um, to wait for that to delve scientific deeper. results. Yeah, yeah, scientific results. Um, Very interesting. Okay, to those people who will be watching us today, either live or um, offline viewing later on um, in YouTube or in, um, in Facebook, um, we just want you to know that what we are sharing with you today are all based on facts, on scientific results. Uh, of course, even scientific results are still open for debate but uh, we would we would like very much to share with you the current scientific results and even with science uh, even with science research everywhere around the world there are still many many things that we still haven't yet discovered that are still being discovered every day so let us keep an open mind and yeah, let's wait for that presentation from Cleo. Cleo, over to you. I'm just going to be later. <laughs> yeah, I was so excited, Dion, because um, when we, we well, I, I am more like the procrastinator sometimes. <laughs> so today we are going to start this talk and then I start searching for some information to share. Although we have it uh, in our, you know, it's in, in our mind, but it's just that a lot of people, you know, they don't see it, they don't believe it. Yes. So that's why I thought uh, we'll, we'll use some normal uh, platforms mm -hmm. as well as some common uh, institutions to support what we're saying today. Yes. So it is not just what we say, but it's actually, you know, a lot of people are out there and they're doing a lot of studies. You can always Google as well, but uh, we would like to share with you some of our findings and some of those that we have already, um, uh, that we already know, all right? So there are a lot more, but it's just that uh, we'll choose a few for you to uh, just go through. And uh, Dion, like what you said just now, yes, um, there is this, uh, if you can see the... the yeah, I mean, I can see, yes, you can see, yeah. Is the uh, water crystal? Yeah, mm -hmm. this is the water crystal. It's a vitalized CT tap water that has been vitalized. And how do you get these water crystals? It's actually done by, um, it, it, it is done with this technology by Dr. Uh, Imoto Masaru. It's a Japanese uh, that came out with this findings that water actually has. Uh, vibration, its own vibration. It has, you know, it can it can be affected by sound, mm -hmm. uh, words, words. Of course, when you pronounce yes. it, but it can also be affected with our thoughts and, and emotion. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you don't have to say it out, but then the vibration of your thoughts or your emotions, it can affect water as well. So, guys. Be careful with what you say and what you think yes. and what you feel, yes. especially when you are dealing with water. Um, if you want a lot of customers to your F&B um, restaurants and cafe, you have to have uh, happy workers. Yes, <laughs> really good feeling, good emotion. It's, it's really interesting to... You, you know, like the old old saying, like how they say water can take up form, you know, like depending on what there is. So um, I think this idea has been around years, donkey years, long, long ago, but there wasn't a way to prove it scientifically until um, with Dr. What's his name? I cannot remember that Japanese. Oh, oh, you mean the but, crystal? Uh, yeah. The, the Emoto, the, the, yeah. the scientists that came up with this experiment, we call it Emoto um, water experiment. So what they did is, you know, like um, 
after, say, for example, um, affecting the water with uh, vibe, um, either with emotion or with sound or with, um, uh, with maybe, um, you know, like any medium. And then after that, how they do this, this experiment, they actually freeze the water. And then after that, look at the, um, the structure the crystalline structure of the frozen water under high micro, um, was that high high resolution microscope. So this is how these particles at the background are clear. You can see there all these um, the the structure of the water. You can actually see. So you can actually see the impact of each of this experiment. How our thoughts or our words or our mood or any other form, even a prayer can actually affect the water. So Cleo, one thing that I was wondering, uh, we say water, right? But that does that also mean that the water that we use, say for example, um, this high vitalized water we use to make coffee, will it affect our coffee as well? Oh, Probably. Yes, yes. yes it does, it does. Um, so that's why anything that is liquid, it can be affected. I will show you a test that was done on olive oil, olive oil, um, in terms of how it changed before and after. All right. Um, I, we don't have the olive oil test for uh, Imaru test, but we have this rainbow test. This is another test that is done. I think it's in Switzerland, if I'm not mistaken, or Austria that they can test the, the, I think this is also the structure of the water, all right, before liquid. and after. Um, oh, any goes. form of liquid, is it? Yes, any form of liquid can be affected. Even crystals, Dion. Um, yeah. If you know about crystal, crystals, mm -hmm. I mean, these can be affected as well. So that's why, um, like, um, there is this crystal, uh, the transparent quartz. Ah. Transparent quartz. Yeah. This yeah. is able to absorb, absorb mm -hmm. energy, yeah. uh, especially bad energy tends to absorb. So um, I, I believe that, uh, of course, uh, clear, clear, probably, this is my, my deduction, okay? Clear <laughs> water or clear quartz, mm -hmm. they, their absorption level is so much higher. Yes. Yes. Yeah. There is some compared um, to uh, other types of liquid. Um, yeah. like you have coffee or you have already made in mm -hmm. coffee or you know tea or something like that because there's other other forms yeah. or other yes. uh, ingredients in there so it 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 you know it would affect it would affect yeah i think so because if you do look at this liquid under um under microscope i think we we can see the structure um all the atomic particles um how how they are being structured it would be so good having Tracy here because trace of Tracy's chemical background, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. But I, I think Tracy is unable to <laughs> on, on Friday yeah, because yeah. She has some, uh, you know, she has to arrange for children and stuff on Friday. So I didn't get her to come in today. But no worries. We can always have another chat next time with Tracy. And since we're in the topic of uh, Dr. Masaru Imoto, Let's watch this short video, Dion. How about that? Okay, yeah. Let's watch this short video of Dr. Masaru Imoto's water experiment. All right. And then I will show you how it was done. Um, well, at least some of the equipment that uh, there are people in, um, I think, in Austria or in Germany, they are doing, they are doing this test now. They can do this test. Yeah, I mean, if we are in in Europe, you know, it's so easy. You can just order yeah. has to be done. Um, but here we don't have anybody doing this. Um, unless if we have somebody doing this, I would like to test a lot of things. <laughs> I think I think here in in at least in Sabah, or I think in Sabah specifically, because of um there is very little demand for things like this. So I think. It's it's very hard for um, organization or company to actually have the the kind the access the facility to, to such facility unless of course um, the government um, organization is willing to open the door to to accept this kind of thing but I doubt it so yeah yes. unfortunately 
but we do have um, you know like access to reports international um, scientific reports so these are what we are sharing with all our viewers today and also beyond even though we don't have the uh, facilities to test this kind of reports here uh, we do have local lab uh, laboratory that can do testings on uh, the water that we have you know uh, so mm -hmm. we can actually see the the chemical composition change before and after okay. with yeah. or without you know that kind of thing so i have i have in 2017 i have ordered this kind of tests uh, chemical tests to just to test the water with and without what happens to high vitality um, high vitalized water and mm. what is the content of uh, non-vitalized water yeah i will share with you guys later on okay let's okay. watch this uh, short video about dr imoto masaru or masaru imoto's uh, water experiment okay mm. masaru imoto yeah that's the right one This is only for six, six minutes. Let's just watch together. It's looking. This next series of photographs are the work of Japanese researcher, Mr. Masuru Emoto from his book, The Message from Water. Mr. Emoto's work provides factual evidence that human vibrational energy, thoughts, words, ideas, and music affect the molecular structure of water. Please remember that water comprises over 70% of a mature human body and covers the same amount on our planet. Water is the very source of all life. This photo shows the beautifully formed geometric design of the Yushi Spring water. This next photo is from the Shimanto River, the last clean spring in Japan. Notice the extraordinary geometric forms. The fact that the molecular structure of water can be affected by our consciousness, our intent, and our sounds is extremely important. This photo is from the Mount Cook Glacier in New Zealand. Mr. Moto has been visually documenting these molecular changes in water by means of his photographic techniques. He freezes droplets of water, then examines them under a dark field microscope that has photographic capabilities. His work clearly demonstrates the diversity of the molecular structure of water and the effects of the environment upon the structure of the water. This photo is from the fountain in Lourdes, France. This photo is from contaminated water from the Yodo River in Japan. In this photo, we can compare the contaminated water with clean stream water. Look at the difference. Mr. Amoda decided to see what effects music would have upon the structure of water. He placed distilled water between two speakers for several hours while playing different music and then photographing the crystals that formed after the water was frozen. This photo is of water being exposed to Beethoven's Pastorale. This photo is the effect of box air for the G-string on the water.
interestingly. Okay. Very, very interesting. Right, um, very interesting uh, presentation there by uh, Imoto Masaru, water experiment. Um, and there are many, many more uh, photos that has been shared before. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see, I have this part. This one is open. Okay. Beautiful, look at that, wow. The I love you looks so nice. <laughs> I love you. Oh yeah, that's you see angels. Yeah, angels. beautiful. Look at that. Um, but this yeah. this bottom part is not a good one. So yeah, see. They're all chaotic. Um, the you see what happens when you say you fool. You know this reminds me of a place uh, where I ordered my coffee. <laughs> you know, a, a very distinguished uh, you know expensive coffee and this this person that was preparing the coffee he, she was like scolding another person while making my coffee and I was like oh no I have to harmonize my coffee I have to harmonize my coffee <laughs> take away um the she keep on calling the other guy uh, the person a fool was stupid that jerk blah 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 and then while making my coffee I was like oh no so I mean knowing all this um, you know about this uh, crystals water crystals how water can be affected with our words with the sound with our thoughts you know it's it's very it really changes me in you know wherever I go yeah I, I make sure that anything that I buy from the shop I will always harmonize it I harmonize it whether it with my own thoughts or I harmonize it with my harmony card you know my how many um, cut he did say just now that you know like if you actually like use our own thoughts i think it will take hours so i think the faster way would be to use that how many card where it's less than five minutes three minutes right yeah it's one minute actually one minute, one minute. Yes, <laughs> you know just you just put it there under your cup and then before you drink your you know your drinks yeah um it's very good because the thing is sometimes we I mean, our mind and our hearts and our emotion get mm -hmm. affected with a lot of things. But this is already, you know, it's already pre-programmed. It's fixed. It yes. is, uh, it will just, you know, it will just uh, uh, harmonize your dreams. That's it. That is the function of the harmony card. All right. It, it improves the vitality of your water. But um, before I go into this, we're going to talk more about high vitality water, Dion. Yes, yes um, let's. <laughs> well, why did we share about harmony card because uh, there were tests where uh, we have seen that water before they activate with uh, with harmony card or with um, a system which is uh, by Shanayan harmonic uh, technology which is the same technology of this harmony card uh, there is um a test that was done, which I'm going to share with you the test report later on, it's in German. And they have done this water test as well. So how it was before or without and after, after they have treated it with a uh, Shanayan harmonic uh, um, product, okay? So let me just share another. Dion, you heard about Lutz, right? Like uh, just yeah. now also showed uh, Lutz. This is, it's, it's, it's one of the sites um, in the world that is well known for its miracle water. So, um, you know, like, you know how we talked about before, like the water can also be affected with prayers. So I think, imagine, because the amount of pilgrims, the amount of people going there, uh, the prayer in Lewis never stopped. I think the prayer is ongoing there like 24 hours every second of the day. There will always be people praying. And then there are monasteries there, I think. Um, the basilica uh, there. Uh, so so it, it's like, um, imagine the, the water spring there has been, um, has been exposed to ongoing prayers for years and years, ever since the first apparition, that first um, 
um, apparition of Mother Mary there. So, you know, like the water there is practically being blessed with so much um, prayer. So, so that is why I think, um, you know, like a lot of people, even my mom, um, uh, my mother-in-law went uh, to join um, the pilgrimage tour there. She actually went back with, with them. With, with water from, from Lutz. So, you know, like they actually bottle this, this water and sell. So, okay, so what is um, the mystery of this? Um, Cleo will share with, with us all, you know, like there are, of course, because prayer can actually affect the water. So Cleo will share with us the um, scientific results of just how much it is actually different and how we can also get similar, similar um, vitalized water from anywhere. Yes, uh, let's just look at the Lutz uh, water crystal again, how it looks like, all right? We know that there are people who, who went to Lutz and like what Dion has shared, her mother also went there. And, uh, you know, they also sell this bottled uh, Lutz water. Why is um, uh, this kind of water is uh, actually good or has high vitality? Why can it help people? But before mm -hmm. that, let's look at the crystal again from Luz. Okay, this was the crystal. Yeah, this is from Luz. Okay, and um, I would also like, apart from Luz, uh, we know that um, there are so many miracles from you know people visiting this place and they drink the water and they feel so much refreshed and they feel so much better and then there was like acute rheumatism they get cured from that just by drinking the water okay how is that possible actually if you look at this this is already one of the scientific uh, proof that loose mm -hmm. has high vitality water okay has very good quality water there and I would like also to share another one. Hey, hang on. Am I sharing already? Not yet. Huh? Another one, which is because we are not talking about religion, right? We are talking about high vitality water. So this is another place that was uh, recorded or reported to have high vitality water or has this beautiful uh crystals as well ah, do you know about this zam zam water yes, zam, zam zam water yeah in zam zam is in uh in maka right uh i'm not sure it, but yeah. <laughs> so, they create zam zam water uh mm -hmm. because they found that a lot of people that went to maka maka they, they prayed and they went to this Zamzam uh, area. There's a well, there's a well in, the, in Zamzam that this water has um, high vitality as well because when people drink from the well, they actually feel more refreshed and energized. And Zamzam is actually in the heart of the Haji pilgrimage in, uh, in Mecca. You know, and, and people, they have tested that they have tested that it actually contains high calcium and magnesium. Okay, in Zamzam, you see, they actually did a test of the chemical components of the water of Zamzam. And this is, I will just go to the summary. Yeah? It has the difference between Zamzam water and other water city. Uh, city water is because the quantity of calcium and magnesium salts, which are actually higher in Zamzam -zam water. And of course, Zamzam -zam water, it says here that they have also fluoride. So this is, and Zamzam -zam water is actually natural water, the same as, you know, as what was uh, shown in the video earlier, some mm -hmm. spring water, they have very, uh, very beautiful crystals, and these are all natural water. All right, so the same as Lutz, water in Lutz as well, they have very high vitality water, but I have not seen the chemical test on, the, on Lutz water. 
All right, mm -hmm. but uh, we have done a test on our own product. Okay, I'm not saying that we can produce uh, exactly the same composition as what they have, yes. Yes. but it is so much better than none. <laughs> yes, okay, exactly. so much better than none. And uh, let me just share with you uh, how it looks like, okay? Oh, a lot of, uh, a lot of reports, huh? Okay, this is how the, uh, can you see it? Yeah, I mean, I can see your screen. Um, this one? Yeah. I can see. Okay. Uh, you can see. It's in German, right? Yes, this is in German. This mm -hmm. is how they did the test of the water crystal. Mm -hmm. This is the microscope that they use. Of course, this uh, person that was doing this test, this is the microscope that the person used. And they always do a test between before and after. Wow. All right. So, yeah. This is Wasser means water. So water Munchen means uh, is in Munich, Munich in Germany. Unbehandled means to say it has not been treated. All right. So this is the original uh, Munich water, and this is how it looks like under the microscope. All right. And mm -hmm. this is how it looks like after it has been treated with our uh, Shenayan Harmonic Technology right. products. All right, you, you see all these crystals? Yeah, it is not as perfect as what we see uh, mm -hmm. with Luz and Zamzam, -Zam, you know, but, but it's, it's, you know, you're already halfway there. Yes. Or more than half, that is very beautiful. You can't get it unless if you go to Luz or you go to Zamzam, -Zam, mm -hmm. but then you finish this water so fast, right? Yeah. So yeah, this is another one. This is distilled water. Distilled water, you know, our bottle of distilled water. Mm -hmm. uh, this is how that it has, looks. That has gone through the distillation process, right? Yes, that's right. Uh, if you if you look at in Malaysia, I don't know about other countries, but in Malaysia, we we know how to separate or this uh, distinguish uh, distilled water and mineral water is by the mm -hmm. cap of the water. Normally, those water with white caps are mm -hmm. distilled water, okay? Guys, look at what you're drinking. <laughs> um, I'm not saying distilled water in Malaysia is like that, but this is, you know, distilled water yeah. that is... Yeah. What about the green cap? Um, there's, 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 there's also green cap and blue cap. Yeah, um, as long as it's colored caps, those are mineral water. It means to say it contains minerals. Okay, our body are biological. I'm not a science student, but I know that <laughs> our body is made of, you know, we need minerals. Yes. minerals. Yes. We need all exactly. kinds of vitamins. Mm -hmm. We need all kinds of nutrients. Okay, and we can get it from our water. Why, why drink distilled water? Well, okay, I'm not <laughs> against distilled water. <laughs> distilled water, I think it's, it's also known as dead water, right? It's devoid of totally everything it, it it has gone through the reverse osmosis is it um, that's true <laughs> actually i have um i have read a report before i'm not sure whether you can still find a report now um whether i should mention but it is by uh it was written uh, for this uh who Okay, mm -hmm. many years ago, I read this report that talked about uh, demineralized water and demineralized water or RO water, okay, reverse osmosis water. Mm -hmm. It was uh, considered as very aggressive type of water, uh, right? It's aggressive type of water. But uh, for those people that is in the lab, you would know that when you, when you clean your, uh, you know, your, your utensils or those mm -hmm. things that use your jars, your testing tubes, you normally use distilled water because yes. it has yeah. nothing in it. It's yeah. clean. It's clean. So when you drink distilled water, you would actually, you know, you're drinking like what you said, Dion, zombie water. <laughs> yes, water. dead water. Yeah. yeah. Because I think I think um this the reason why we have distilled water, again, as you said, it's for cleaning purposes. And also I think um those kind of water that actually being used um, to make soaps or to make, um, you know, like other 
other stuff, you know, because they they try they need to use water that is devoid of any other minerals to actually I think to stop um, any chemical reaction from happening, you know, like all those unwanted or un unpreferred or maybe undesirable minerals that could be present if um, uh, normal water tap is being used. So you know, like um, I do. I make soaps as well and yeah. and some herbal products and always right the the um the instruction i get is to use distilled water so oh. <laughs> yeah so i think that's because um because i'm going for you know like um uh they call it oil base oil based um products that has some you know like when you do um want to make a product without um without preservative they always uh, encourage you to go oil based because there is no water content there precisely for this reason you know like yeah. if you have water you will have minerals and then the minerals could you know like um, become food for bacteria and other stuff yeah. and it would also uh it would also interrupt with the quality that you want mm, why exactly. you use still water because it's very net um well it's it's basically neutral it's nothing in there. That's nothing. Yeah. So that is why I mean our body needs water with minerals and as yeah. as much vitality as possible. Even when we actually water our plants, of right. course we need. So you know, like that is why um, if you do follow AEI um, website or Facebook, you would also see you know like um, the garden products. You know like um not i mean the the garden produce from using vitalized water you can see just how big and how fat these vegetables these fruits are and how healthy they look so these are just one of those um testimony that um we do not normally you know like there are so many of them that i think we just take for granted right Cleo? right that's right that's right, Dion, because a lot of things, um, people are not aware about it. So that's mm -hmm. why we're doing all these talks to share with everybody um, about things that we have already learned, things mm -hmm. that we are already aware so that more people would learn about it and then they can share with other people as well. Um, all right. So, I mean, even though distilled water is, it looks like this, um, there is nothing in distilled water that's zero minerals you know but in terms of energy in terms of energy by looking at this crystal water shape right um you it also tells you that the energy is actually it, it's all broken up you know it's not complete so when we treat it with our shenayan harmonic technology product this is how it looks like for distilled water so, so though there is no minerals but the vitality of the water can be enhanced still because um it is more on energy it's the frequency it's the frequency yeah. it's like um jazzing up uh the 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 water molecular to actually have more uh vitality vitality That's here right. you know like maybe some people think of how is that possible it's just I mean, everything is all about vibration. And like the one thing that we really like to talk about in at least like when when I'm with Cleo or with, with, with Tracy and Cleo, we always talk about the uh, energy, vibration, because everything vibrates. Everything vibrates on its own frequency. So it's all about energy, things that we cannot see. So just like this one here, um, you know, like, Water is, I think, one of the basic things that is, you know, like the olden, olden saying says that it can actually take up any form, anything around it. Uh, there is a particular saying on the water, but it totally went over my head. It's okay, Cleo, over to you. I, uh, I'm wondering. <laughs> Okay, so so maybe she's uh, you know there's a lot of all these crystals. Yeah, she, so many things. <laughs> or crystals too. I need, yeah, I need coffee. <laughs> so I'm putting in um what do you call that uh 
intention here. Focus. <laughs> Focus. <laughs> we can we can do a test with all those uh, friends on Facebook in a while. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, we can we can do a test. Okay. Whether mm -hmm. you yourself are able to improve the quality of your water. All right. Let's do a test in a while. Just uh, let's let's get more people to come in. Uh, share with people. Share with your friends. Okay. Get them to come in before yeah. we go there, okay? So I'm gonna share with you next is, this is also water. This is uh, in Switzerland. This is the water in Switzerland that is not treated, okay? It has not been treated. Wow, you see almost a complete uh, crystal, even yeah. without treating, yeah? Mm -hmm. So Switzerland water, you know that it's very, very clear. It's very, very, the air is very fresh. It's very mm -hmm. crisp, it's very refreshing, you know? And this is how it looks like after it has been treated with aqua volatilizer, which is a Shanayan harmonic technology product. All right, it has so much more vitality to the okay. product, to the water, yeah, to the water. You see that? Wow, amazing. Yeah, imagine this is the kind of thing um, you feed into your body now. Yeah. Course, Which one do you prefer, this one or this one? Beautiful things are always. Or this one. Uh, or this one. <laughs> uh, Which one do you prefer inside your body? Yeah, that's right, Dion. That's a good question. <laughs> Which one do you guys prefer, friends on Facebook? Huh? Yeah. yeah, I mean... Friends who are watching this video later on, all right, you can you can think of it for yourself and uh, you know, and taste the water yourself, all right. You can taste the water before with low vitality and high vitality water. Beautiful, all right. There is also let me just share with you another one. Okay. Okay. Let me just share with you another one, which is this one. This one is the rainbow test. Um, like I mentioned earlier, they can do a rainbow test. They, they test on the colors of the water structure, how it looks like. Um, I'm not sh really sure of how they do this test yet, but I'm sure it is also using the microscope with some kind of technology, all right? I think, so I think it's... Um, they go with, you know, like spectrum um, sort of, they capture the frequency. Ah. So in, instead of structure, they go um, by frequency wise because the only way um, for, yeah, because colors, they show up at different frequencies, right? So I think that's how they capture because microscope normally, yeah. I think should be. I mean, we are not scientific people. So I'm not scientists. I am a accounting and finance background. Yeah. yeah. Accounting and finance background, and I can talk about this. Okay. Yeah. So um <laughs> I, I'm sure uh, Tracy, Tracy will yes, be the one that has been able to explain to you in terms of uh, technicality. So yeah. but here this is water from uh Tutsing. Tutsing, this is before treatment with our Shenine harmonic uh, technology product and mm -hmm. and this is after look at so that it's smoother mm -hmm. it is smoother you can see the texture it is this is all you know it's all broken up mm -hmm. uh, individual it's not connected this is how it looks like after it's been treated with Shenine harmonic technology product and it looks so much smoother it, you know, it connects with the other part. It's, it, you know, it's more harmonic than this one. Uh, yes, the word is harmonic. Yeah. The word is harmonic. Right? Compared to this, uh, to the before one, it looks more like um, broken up. It's, yes. it's, it's chaotic. Yeah, that's right. It's chaotic. Artistic people would love that, you know, like, yeah. the more abstract it is, <laughs> the nicer it is. <laughs> Okay, and then and then another one is this. This is olive oil. Wow. Okay, this is olive oil before it is being treated. 
All I right. wonder how it looked like after. Yeah. Let's, uh, you want to see how it looks like after? Let me take a guess. Wow. Not much difference, is it? After. I mean, okay. After. Ooh, after, this one. Wow. This is before. This is enhanced. Okay, the, the rainbow color is so much more prominent also as compared to this one. Yes. Yeah, though. No. <laughs> I mean, if only we know exactly um, how or what the testing, the test, the rainbow test is looking at, I mean, from what perspective and from what point of view, I think we would be able to make sense of this. this um, yeah, the, that's right. I would yeah. like to visit this person uh, one day, one day. When I, when I do, I will share with you guys, okay? And yeah. then this is uh, water, also city tap water of Alna Gerberg. Right, uh, I'm sure it's uh, somewhere in Europe. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is before and this is after. Oh, be handled. Okay, sorry, sorry. This is before. Before, I see. Be handled. Wait, wait, wait. Meet Bloom des Labels. Oh, oh, oh this one is already after, after. This is after. Uh, I think, I guess this is another brand, uh, another brand of name that for Shanayan Harmonic Technology product. Mm -hmm. And this is before and this is after. Sure. Yeah. I have to check. I have no Let idea. me check. Let me check whether this is also a Shanayan Harmonic because. I'm not familiar with this one. Maybe, uh, it, maybe after, but it doesn't look very nice. Around yes, this area. maybe maybe it's it's of another um what do you call that another product. Yes, another um product similar to um similar to Shen Shenayanic because yeah. I think um, there are quite yeah. a few I read that you know like. Especially with the Emoto, um, Emoto water experiment, um, there are I think that I know of one or two company that actually followed up with his work even after his death in twenty fourteen, and um, they were all based in German I think, and then they all came up with um, ways to harmonize the water as well, not yeah. harmonize. I think for oh, uh, they, they, they are they are companies that produce things like what we have here as well, uh, which is the Shenayan Harmonic Technology, but I I don't have samples of them, so I'm not sure whether that Bloom is one of them. So um, let me let me find out. I will find out. This one is the Shenayan Harmonic, right? Yeah. It's Shenayan S I H. Yeah, Shenayan right. Harmonic. This is so, so it's much more harmonic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So smooth. It's like yeah. um, having a, <laughs> a rainbow you know, waves of, of you, know, <laughs> you know, very harmonic waves of water coming. Makes me feel like I'm on, on a, you know, like on a wave on top of somewhere, um, like surfing. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's you there. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, this is rainbow and that is what we have for uh, Shanayan harmonic technology. Okay, mm -hmm. so wow, beautiful, huh? Very beautiful. You know, like if 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 we can actually have a way to see just what kind of how how is our drinking water looks like every day. I think we would <laughs> want to drink our water sometimes. <laughs> and you know, like to actually know that it is so susceptible to surrounding, you know, like music. Just, just imagine if somebody is tur turning on, you know, like heavy metal music. And then I think I can, I can imagine how um, heavy metal music can, can, you know, like really affect the water because of the bass, because of the way the thumping here and there, it, it really sort of like um, shake the water molecule, really chaotic. So, and also how, you know, like if you actually make it listen to classical music, wow. <laughs> <laughs> classical music. But um, I think, 
you know, like most of us every day, we take it for granted. You know, like um, the things, water is one of the things that our body needs the most. I think we can survive long enough without food, but we won't survive long without water. And yeah, and then I think I've read before as well, um, how much, you know, like when our body is sick, sometimes all we need is actually water. That's true. Um, True. What we need. So water can reduce inflammation in our body or mm -hmm. fever. You can use mm -hmm. water to uh, reduce. Out. Yeah, that's right. <clears throat> Not only flushing out, like uh, for example, if you're using a high vitality water, uh, mm -hmm. it can actually reduce fever much faster than it's compared to normal water. You can try it, okay? Um, I this did. is part I did. Of <laughs> Yeah, I mean, yeah. friends on Facebook or so, you can try. Okay. Yes. While, uh, while we're on this, uh, Dion, let me just share with you because we touched on about Harmony Card. So we did a test with a, a, um, a um, gentleman in, uh, in, in uh, Penampang. Okay, we did a test with him. We actually activate the, uh, the uh, I think it was a distilled water, right? distilled water. We activated the, we used the Harmony Card Mm -hmm. to activate when we say we activate is basically we put the cup on mm -hmm. top of the harmony card mm -hmm. and we leave it there for like one two minutes and then uh this is how we activate our water okay so mm -hmm. the what activate the water are mostly um has higher vitality has higher vitality but how does it um that is what we say and mm -hmm. we also say that high higher vitality water tastes better better than non uh, non vitalized water okay mm. or or low vitality water doesn't taste as good as high vitality water lah, okay so let's listen to an independent person we do not know him but he came to our our counter and he he offered to test the water all right so this was the test it was in um, bahasa malaysia though uh, Dion, if you can uh, just explain to them later about uh -huh. how what it is uh, mentioned in English, yeah? Okay. Just, okay. Uh -huh. Okay. Let's watch this. Ya, apa rasanya uncle? Kita coba dia punya perbezaan. Ya, ini berat. Ya. Ya, berat. Tapi yang itu yang selepas kau taruh itu harmoni ya iron plate tu ya iron plate and then tadi saya minum rasa dia macam ringan tu air uh, kalau kalau ini sama ini mana satu angkel suka minum memang rasa yang ringan juga lah saya suka minum <laughs> mau minum lah ada penggesaan dia mau minum lah angkel <laughs> supaya minum. lebih sihat <laughs> Ya, macam akali. Akali, sudah kan? Ya, okay. macam akali. Oke, <laughs> oke, okay. okay, thank you. Ringan. Okay. Ada beza lah, ada perbezaan. Oke. Okay. Ini air yang tidak kena lopak tu. Oke. Okay. Introducing the new Dutch Lady Max Grow Packs. Mommy, a complete diet really helps. That's why you have to drink this. Somewhere. Our ambitions are in reach with Dutch Lady Max Grow. Okay. <laughs> it went into advertisement. Okay. Um. Uh. Basically, the guy. I mean, um, the gentleman earlier. Uh. In that in that experiment was saying that between the two glass of water, I mean, not glass, paper cup, paper cup of water. I think um, the experiment, he was given a, the same, um, I think he was shown, not in the video, but uh, in, in real time, of course, that uh, when they poured the water, it was from the same bottle of mineral, uh, distilled water bottle. Um, in front of him, where um, this water has been poured into the two cups. One cup has been uh, vitalized or activated with um, the uh, GHC, Gold Harmony card. 
while the other one was left as a control the control cup, meaning it hasn't been um, activated or anything, just as it is. So what he was saying, what the gentleman was saying, that the difference he felt was the activated water tasted or felt like lighter on his um, tongue, you know, like much, um, I think he meant by lighter was the taste wise, while the unactivated, the pure distilled water is heavy, you know, like, um, I don't know how to, to, to describe, but he was saying um, in his own words, one is heavy, one is lighter. So I think he might be saying that according or depending on the taste that he felt as well, he tasted. I think it could be um, lighter, could mean that he, he felt it was sweeter as well, maybe. I'm not sure. <laughs> what do you think, Cleo? He, he did say that it tastes uh, so much lighter as in, you know, the aftertaste, it, it tastes much better. It tastes think, much better. Yeah. yeah. I, think, I think what he meant was, you know, like when we drink some, uh, something sometimes, there is um, that will stay on your tongue, on your taste, but for a longer time you know like heaviness like a layer a layer of it but um while the activated one i think it was so light that you know like after drinking it there is no aftertaste i think there i think is no heavy heavy kind of taste um i i would say it's more like a chemical taste you know yes. heavy taste. yeah i agree with you about that yeah so yeah. Normally, I, I see there is a question here on, uh, on Facebook. Does the water taste different? Yes, actually, uh, DJ Luisa, it, it does taste uh, different and it is uh, so much. I mean, if you have tested it, you would also know the difference as well, uh, because it normally tastes so much sweeter to me. It tastes sweeter to me and also tastes much better and smoother and smoother. All right. So yeah. this is one of them that I wanted to share with you. And there is another one that we have done. This is done in at home, okay? Activating home boil drinking water, all right? Let me just share this video with you, a very short one, four, point, uh, four minutes. Okay, this is at home. So that's why I said um, after Hello, this, we okay. can actually do this. We're going to do some testing here. Uh, my sister is going to activate the water. So we just want to see whether there's any changes. Now, uh, my sister, Carol, can you like taste both water, the both uh, water from both glasses and taste if there is any difference? Okay, my dear sister Carol, can you activate this glass of water? How do you activate? You just put your hands like this over your cup and say that I send love, healing, harmony, energy into this water. Okay, now, can you try the water? See if there's any difference. No difference. No. No one? Okay. So I'm going to try, I'm going to activate this water. I'm activating this water with love, healing, harmony, energy. Okay. Try the other one first. Try and see whether there's any difference. This one tastes better. How does it taste like? Is it like lighter, softer, or more keras, more soft, less aggressive? 
Huh? This year. Great. So if you are given the choice of this cup of water and this cup of water, which one will you drink? Yay. So, okay. Now, if I were to put how many card? Activate this water now. Let's see. Let's activate it for uh, one minute. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, okay. So can you try the water again? This one, drink this one first. And then that one. See which one do you like? Or well, what's the difference? It's better from just now. Better from just now. In between these two glasses, which one better? That one better. Softer. Can you show No one better. All righty. Thank you very much, my sister, dear Carol. And she has finished like one, two, three, four glasses of water. <laughs> okay. Thank you, Caroline, my sister. Okay. That was a test that was done at home. <laughs> I made her drink so much water. Uh, so that we can do the test because I wanted uh, another person to test the water instead of myself. And mm -hmm. she's not into all this uh, harmony, energy kind of things. She's very neutral. She's a school teacher. You know, school teachers, they tend to be very uh, strict in a lot of things. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. So, um, and I... I do trust her taste. Only thing is uh, why she was uh, having that, um, maybe it looks like difficult to, to um, explain or describe is because they are not used to, you know, different yeah. type of uh, description of water. So yes. I think, yeah. <laughs> so are you guys ready? I see there are some friends on Facebook. Are you guys ready? Do you want to try and activate your own water <laughs> with your hands? I, I I just activated my coffee. <laughs> you yeah. know, like before that, my my coffee was bitter. Was, okay. Uh, <laughs> I if you want like, to do the test, if you want okay. to do the test, if you want to know whether it was successful or not, all right. Okay, because every person, every person has their own energy. Mm -hmm. And as we have learned today with uh, Imoto Masaru and all this, uh, the test, they have already shown that words, intention, thoughts, emotions do create some kind of frequencies. So let's feel for yourself what is your own frequency with water. How about that? Let's Can do I it. <laughs> um, you have to have two different glasses, um, same <laughs> sources of water or same sources of drinks. All right. Mm -hmm. Um, for comparison purposes, if you only have one, how are you going to compare? So yeah. you take uh, you take two glasses of water. Um, the best is water because it's uh, you know you can really taste the difference. Mm -hmm. Okay, friends on Facebook, come come try try. Christy, I, the last I will, time, you yeah, I, I, I will <laughs> try some other day because um, 
if I were to go and pick up, <laughs> then I would I have know, to. It's okay, it's okay, dear. We just get our friends on Facebook yeah. to try it. We'll just guide them how to do it, okay? Uh, friends on Facebook or those who are watching this video right now, um, the replay. So mm -hmm. just try it yourself, okay? What you do is take two glasses of water. Quick, quick, take two glasses of water. If you have done, just say done in, uh, in you're ready in uh, Facebook. Uh, for those friends that is watching this replay, you know, you take your own time. Uh, for those on Facebook, just say, uh, type that you have your glasses ready, then I will tell you what to do. <laughs> Let me answer, Tracy. Okay, anybody want to try? Try it. Try it and share with us how it feels, how it tastes like. Okay, let's try it. What you need to do is just get two glasses of water from the same source. Okay, if you have one jar of water, use that one jar of water and fill up two of your glasses with water. Okay, are you ready? Okay, I need some water also. Okay, get your jar of water, fill up your cup. I think we have, to, we, we, we have to let them know that when they are forming the thoughts, right, you must focus, you know, like just like when you command something to do something, they must be full, um, they call that when, when you are going to say the words later, make sure you put everything into it, you know, like your mind and heart must be on the same page. Yeah, you, cannot, right. you cannot do it like your mouth say something, but your mind is thinking about something else and your heart is thinking about something else. So yes, all these yes. three, mind, um, at, least, at least mind and mouth and heart, if you want to say it, must be same direction, um, same page. But if you just want to think about it, but not say, can also, but then these two must be doing the same thing. Heart and mind. But Heart, your mouth mind is... and your... <laughs> Don't say anything, it's okay. But your mind and your heart must be on the same length right. or the same direction. If you think about love, 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 love. Well, I said it out, so that's different. Yeah, you can, yeah. You can do that too. You have to think, you have to feel, you have to, I mean, you can say it if you want. If you don't want, it's okay. But uh, just get your two cups ready. One cup, okay, I guess everybody's ready, yeah? So mm -hmm. one cup, one of your cup, you think of that word that you want to say. Uh, say, for example, love, uh, harmony, peace, whatever, you, you can choose, you know, those words at the back. Don't All say right? that you fool. <laughs> you fool, okay? Don't say you fool, I'm going to cover it. <laughs> and cover, cover. Don't say, don't say you fool. <laughs> yeah, you say all this, any of these words, um, you don't have to say too many words. If you say, if you say two words to begin with, then just continue with that same two words. Don't keep on changing. It must be the same, all right? You try it and whether you can do it. The reason why we have all these how many cars, all these products is because it only emits the same frequency 24 hours, 365 days, you know, it doesn't change. It's already exactly. fixed, it's already pre-programmed. Uh, unlike with uh, humans, we tend to get affected by all kinds of things. So when you do this, it improves your vitality. Um, what? Cleo, there is some, some, some message in Facebook I will read. Mommy, <laughs> that's <laughs> name. I want to say yes. okay. I think I think can. Uh, well, you can try. You can try. No worries. 
you can try whatever yes. words you want just say something that is positive you don't say i want to slim down i slim down yes the word is um, it, it it has to be a result yes, um, it has to be the result it's not i want to slim down i slim down uh, it's something that is present. Oh dear, I you know what? I, I feel like I sound more and more like my husband. <laughs> yeah. Um please don't, you know, like while 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 you're holding your glass and saying, I said, I have um peace, peace, and then suddenly somebody calling you outside said, Hey, you fool, stop it, be quiet. And <laughs> ah, don't do that. Okay. You must be entirely focused. And I would also suggest that you put both of your feet down on the floor, both your soles of your feet touch the floor so that you are grounded. When you are grounded, your connection up and down are more harmonious, you see? Yeah. So do that and then you say all this positive yeah. words to your drinks and then, well, you can, you can put your hands like that because a lot of energy in our palms, all right? Yeah. Um, a lot of energy in our palms uh, for, for uh, people who have gone through a CHIMAC education or CHIMAC Institute uh, courses, they will have, they naturally will have higher energy in their palms. Yeah. But uh, for those who doesn't, you still have your own energy as well. All right. You have your own energy. Do this and activate your own water now. Feel like that. Um, it's okay. it's interesting that you said just now, clear how you know, like our feet has to oh, be so much better <laughs> <laughs> because um, it has also something to do with our chakra. You know, like um, we are all about opening up the the points of energy on our uh, body field energy so it's all about opening up that chakra as well so that is the flow top say either way i mean top to bottom eh, top to bottom <laughs> bottom to up <laughs> yeah i activated my coffee and how does it, it taste like it tasted less bitter but also less sweet and lighter you know like um because i actually use a very uh, thick um coffee coffee uh, mixture so i like it very very thick and heavy but then now uh, after the continuous um you know like i've been putting uh, intention on it it it's really, you know, like very, um, what's the word, chawera? <laughs> chawera, I mean, it's less heavy, it's um, less more sweet, diluted. Yeah, less bitter, yes. And Everything more diluted, is, I guess. Yeah, diluted, yes, yeah. that's the word. It tasted more diluted. <laughs> My water also tastes so much better. It tasted uh, much uh, smoother than before. Mm hmm. Mm. Yes, yeah. because we boil our water with electric kettle. Mm. So, uh, but even on our electric kettle, we have this harmony card that is, you know, attached to it. So that after it is boiled, uh, the harmony card will automatically just activate the water uh, <laughs> so that it's less aggressive. So um, how about those friends? How do you feel? Uh, ha, ha, ha. So before makan, mau bagi tahu perut jangan godot. <laughs> perut makan sikit. Watery. Uh, DJ Luisa says watery. I think um, I'm not sure if 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 I have I you think... done it, DJ Luisa or friends, other friends? Have you done it? Yeah. Share with us what is your your experience. How do you experience it? Does it taste better? You know, um, on your own energy, yeah? so you're actually testing your own energy. <laughs> uh, I've tried putting in the harmony card before on the soup. You know, ah. 
um, my initial uh, my initial intention was to make the soup taste thicker and better. You know what happened? <laughs> Completely the opposite. I said, okay, <laughs> but I wonder why. But I think yeah, what it does is it maybe it it really blends it together. So that's why it tastes lighter. <laughs> lighter. It <moves> out. <laughs> I was like, okay, um, maybe maybe our viewers can try as well. Try especially with um, thick soup. You'll see the difference. You know, thick soup, as it cools down, it's supposed to be thicker. But if you use it on um, uh, on how many card, you will notice instead of getting thicker, <laughs> it will get watery. <laughs> Wait, I, but that can be explained because you know why I have also done a test before mm -hmm. um, uh, water with uh, activated with harmony card and water without okay we have found that water that has been activated with harmony card the the absorption level is so much uh, faster mm -hmm. it's so much better it means Thanks. to say the molecules are so much smaller so mm -hmm. if you say that it is more watery, it is possible because it becomes smaller molecules. I'm yes. sure if it's uh, thicker, the molecules are much bigger, you know, so that it can bind together. But when it's smaller, you know, it, it becomes more loose. Yeah, so that's why, that's why it is like that. I think uh, Tracy can uh, also comment that. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Siapa, siapa? Sudah, digit. So that try. Oh, okay. So that try with your hands. Okay, never mind. You can try with your hands. Uh, if not, then you know, uh, you yeah. can do it anytime later as well. You can get another, you can get another family members to do what you do, and then yeah. you try, you try the results. Okay, you try the results. All right think, for yourself. I think it will be interesting to have those people, you know, with. With healing hands, you know those people um who are who who some people say oh that person is very good in giving massage or you know like they can that they, they can take away pain you know these people because they are I mean everybody is born with certain degree of um we call it energy level or gifts in their hands so some of us are born with higher uh, energy level on the hands. So these are the people naturally will, you know, when they give massage, it will be so much more effective. So these people, when they do give energy, you know, like do this kind of thing, I think that it will be so much um, obvious, the, the effect of this experiment, because of naturally the level of energy is higher. That's Can, true. That's yeah. true. That's true. But the only thing is because we are all humans, even when you have high vitality hands, uh, high energy in your palms or your body, you mm -hmm. tend to get affected by emotions. Yes. You know, sadness, anger, uh, irritation, those kind of things. So uh, you have to make sure that you are really in good mood, good emotion, very positive, very happy, and very peaceful in order to do that. Then you can sell really, really a lot of water you know, just activate it. You know, you can call it Dion water, or you know. Yeah. But <laughs> like the best thing is, the best thing is still using that tool. You know, like that's why we have this tool to help us, because the tool, like um, the harmony card, it will never change, regardless of what the feeling is. You know, like your emotion or your mood is, you can always revert back, or you you can always go back and use the harmony card because that is one tool that will not change. Or yeah. if if you have um, crystals lying around you, you can also use the crystals. But be um, the best kind of crystal to use is of course the raw crystal if you want to use crystals instead of the harmony card. But again, you cannot put those crystals direct into your water. Don't. <laughs> I mean, please do complete research because um, crystals, not all crystals are safe. Uh, to be put directly into the water you are drinking because they they do come from beneath the earth and there are those that come with 
toxins, minerals that are toxin, like arsenic, plumbum. Yeah. So the best yes. thing is always to go for how many card. Now it's the easiest one. Yeah. You know, like if you want to bring along your crystals, it's so big, you want to put them in your bag, <laughs> it's so heavy, or you might just, you know, like damage them in the process. But compared to how many card, like the one Cleo is holding, it's so light, it's so it's so small, you can put it in your bra if you want to. <laughs> you can put it in your pocket, everywhere, anywhere. Um, you just take it out. So the, the thing, the advantage of how many card is because of its shape and then um, the flexibility of the size, you can use it for everything, for anything, any pain on your body, you can use it um, for your food, you can even use it in front of your computer, you know, like just to neutralize um, the EMF pollution, um, practically anything to harmonize. Yeah, uh, for ladies especially, uh, we tend to be more emotional than the men, okay? So when we are more emotional, we tend to have pain around this area, this area. Yeah. Yeah, this area, because I know I have some pain too. It's actually considered as inflammation. And if it gets worse, it can become cancer. So that's why a lot of women, they tend to have breast cancer. Okay, so what you can do is um, we do have customers that use the Harmony card um, that actually have lumps, you know, lumps here. And they use this and they put it inside. Of course, they have to put it inside your bra. And then you put it here for, I think, one week. And the lump is, you know, it's it's no more there, okay? It's no mm -hmm. more there. The person is healthy, uh, of course. And we also have customers that had lump here. Um, I think she was a third stage um, of cancer. Uh, and it was a relapse. And she, she put the Harmony card. We taught her how to use this. She just put the Harmony card here. And she does it every day. But of course... How many cut alone cannot cure cancer, okay? Cannot reverse your cancer condition. You need to be in a very, um, your emotional state have to change as well. The things that you eat, your supplementation, you need all these kind of things. You have to have good sleep. You have to have, uh, you have to be free from any, um, any geopathic stress or um, frequencies or anything that is negative in terms of frequencies, all right? So it is a holistic way of healing. Yes. Just one harmony card. We are not doing magic, okay? The only person who can help us is ourselves, yes. all right? It, it, you have to be everything. It has to be holistic, all right? Mm -hmm. Our harmony card can support you. It only supports, all it's right? We're not replacing yeah. anything else because you see, as you can see, we did not put anything into the water, nothing, but it improves the water quality. Why? I can share with you, uh, friends, of a, a lab test that I have done on water. All right, let me just share with you this test. This is the test result that was um, done in 2017. Can you see my screen? Uh, yeah. I can see your screen. Okay, can you see this? This is uh, this was done by Chem Science uh, consultants in Yambahat. It's in Kota Kinabalu. Oh, it's a bit small. Okay. Yeah. Okay, it's big and enough. This is a lab test that tests chemicals. Um, I I have sampled two bottles of water. One is non-activated, means to say I just take the water from the tap water, uh, from the tap, and this is. Uh, I've used the tap water, the same tap water sauce, and activate it with uh, our Harmony card. All right, with our Harmony card at the time, that was in 2017. All right, the, the, the chemical composition of it are, I mean, I've tested for all this. All right, pH value, you can see that it is more alkaline. All right, because I only put it for like one, two minutes, I think, at that time. All right, one, two minutes. Before, I mean, without Shanayan activation, this is how the, it's more acidic, all right? 6.45 is acidic and 6.54 is more towards alkaline, all right? It's going that way. 
Yes. And this free residual chlorine, uh, without using the harmony card, it was the reading was 0 0.7. And after activated, the water sample has, you know, is untraceable. Less than 0 0.10 is, uh, is actually untraceable. Free residual chlorine, as we know, uh, I'm not sure whether you all know what is free residual chlorine. Um, like me in 2017, I really don't know what it was until I asked this person. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Tracy would I, I don't know because um, I'm not a science student. I'm an accounting and finance background. All right. Yeah. So it's basically uh, she's saying that whatever that is left in the water, the chlorine content that is less left in the water. All right. So that is what you call. Uh, Okay, here there is combined residual chlorine, both also nothing, all right? And then total dissolved solids. These are more like, uh, um, I think these are more like uh, other minerals. Ah, okay. It's other minerals. Um, hang on, uh, let me just check. I, I checked about it earlier, let me just see. Okay, total dissolved solids are more like inorganic salts or organic matter that is present. It's something like calcium, magnesium, sodium, potassium, carbonate, hydrogen, carbonate, chloride, sulfide, or all those things are, that is in the water. The minerals. Right? Yeah, those are the minerals. And of course, these are still within the approved range. Okay. Um, high range will be considered, uh, I think, more than 100, I think. Let me see. Or more than 1,000 is considered. Uh, too high <laughs> too much too, too much yeah. so too much is not good okay too low also is not good, low, <laughs> not good. Mm -hmm. okay uh, naturally occurring that's not okay all right and of course a lot of people they were advised to drink more alkaline water right so yeah it's actually proven that activated water is more alkaline than non-activated of the same source, all right? And then hardness, hardness, this is also mineral content. This is uh, normally uh, calculated based on the calcium and magnesium, all right? So it's much higher. So you see, we did not put anything into the water. It's already in the water. <laughs> it's already in the water. Uh, it's it's only thing is that once you activate it, the water molecules become smaller. Everything that is in the water becomes, you know, it, it surface. Yeah, it comes out. It's easier to be detected. All right, so that is about the test. <laughs> yeah, so many facts, uh, things that we can share, yeah? Yeah, it's, it's actually, um, a lot more out there but maybe before this it never occurred to most of us to actually go and have a look but after this do us a favor don't just take us for what we say but go and um, have a read search for emoto e-m-o-t-o emoto water experiment or just you know like um uh water yeah, I think the best one would be to search under Emoto water experiment. Then you can see all the information um, about this, about how water can actually retain, um, you know, like how we can affect water structure only right. by um, vibration, frequency, everything. Actually, when, when, when we really think about it, everything at at the basic um, level, everything works, the way everything works is via vibration, via frequency. So that is why in the industry now, um, wellness topic like essential oil, like um, energy, um, like, uh, got like chi, like crystals. Now all these are very, very happening you know, like the topic to go to at the moment, because, you know, like the one good thing COVID did for us is it, it confined us to our home and give us more time to actually just learn, simply learn and to look for alternative. And 
these are the things that we can do for ourselves, you know, like vitalize the way we live. And then the best way to do that is by changing the very basic thing, which is the water we drink every day. If we can vitalize our water, it surely can support us in our journey towards healthier life. Right, Leo? That's right. That's right. Um, I mean, let's go back. <laughs> 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 that's right Dion um, so a lot of a lot of things in our life can change with higher vitality water uh, because um, the thing is our entire body uh, majority also contains water so if if your words or emotions or your thoughts can affect water that is beyond your body think about how it actually affects within your body Exactly. And maybe, if, and maybe some of our friends out there, again, I love to repeat this every time we are on the same session with Cleo. How, how does um, the gold card, how many, I mean, how many gold card can actually work? You know, like, won't it be um, competing? Say, for example, you have a, you are having a bad day. You are quite sad or having a, quite not good you you are not in a good mood and that surely will affect the water that you're drinking and then at the same time you can use some you know like you have a uh, harmony card with you and you put it maybe you are thinking won't it you know like because you are in constant um bad bad day you know like you are having um you are in a negative sort of ne negative uh, vibe so maybe you are thinking, how can that work? You know, like you yourself is in negative mode, but then um, although you have that, uh, you call that, that card with you, won't it still affect um, your drink? Now, here is another um, scientific fact that I came across um, during one of my research, is that the way things work is that when we are in negative state in, in a not so good um place you know like with negative thoughts and sad and all these things those actually translate into lower frequency lower vibration so what what um what the gold card harmony can do for us because those these things and all those high vibrating things they vibrate at higher level so um everything will always try to balance itself so what what it can do for us is these um, high vibration material or things, I can say things or material because it can be a crystal, it can be a gold card harmony, it doesn't matter. What these things can do is um, it can lift up our body vibration. And yes, the thing that Cleo is holding is aqua vitalizer. Now that one is small, but the impact is so much bigger. I don't know how many more times bigger than um, Oh, a thousand times better. Yes, a thousand times better. It's stronger. This so, is 650,000 uh, in terms of uh, energy, energy measurement, uh, 650,000 QU. And this is about 9,000, almost 10,000. You know, so, just by looking at that here, I can feel the, <laughs> the energy. Oh, of the <laughs> I'm the enough, you can feel the energy of all these things I'm holding. Uh, you can even feel the energy coming from me or also Dion. Yeah. All right. So we, we do have, uh, we, every person emits a kind of energy. And I have energized my water and it tastes so much better. So, um, you know, like those, having those things and then our body at a low vibration. So what it does is um, as, as us and our surrounding try to get into balance because everything gets into balance. So um, indirectly, our body's vibration will be raised higher. So that is the science behind it. So in case you are wondering, in case you are wondering. So that is how um, all these um, AI uh, products can help to raise our vibration and also the crystals and anything that is of high vibration, even essential oils. So that's right, yeah. that's right, Dion. Uh, just uh, just to share with you, because just now I was sitting in front of the, uh, although it is just a screen, mm -hmm. 
Mm -hmm. But I can tell you that my back was feeling a bit painful. You know, <laughs> I was thinking behind the you fool that that picture. Mm -hmm. I can the sense. Oh yes. Yeah, yeah. I, I can sense my back was starting to be painful to start to pain. That's why I changed my background photo. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, for me, looking at it now right now, so much better than just now, okay? So yeah. even, even with just the, you know, whatever that is behind you, spiritually or physically or digitally, it can see visually. It can affect you. It can affect us, okay? It can affect us. And, and that is true, Dion, uh, whatever all these energy products or all these products with higher energy or higher vitality, that we have around us or in our house, it actually helps our, you know, it helps the whole family. It helps exactly. us, it helps the entire family. All right. So that you don't have people walking around feeling like, you know, so tired every day, you know? And, and um, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I just wanted to say one thing. And in case if you're feeling so down and you don't have anything of high vibration, um, stuff with you what you can do is just look around if you see any group of people laughing like crazy having um, having the time of their life laughing and being happy you just go there and just look at them because you know their vibes can also help you you know all yes, the vibes from people <laughs> happy people yes. uh, um, or people who pray a lot uh, you know they are more positive more happy um, of course, you don't mix with people that really, um, people you know, that, <laughs> yeah, people call them, they term them as toxic people, but this type of people are more like, you know, they gossip a lot and then they talk bad about other people, that kind of things. So try to stay away from those kinds because um, I'm not saying that they are bad. It's just that the energy, it can actually affect you, you know, it can affect you. Very draining. Um, oh, they suck. And, they and suck. While, while we're talking about energy of humans, we also can talk about energy of places, okay? The land or the house or, you know, buildings. Um, as you know, that wherever we go, there are things that is unseen. Um, yes. That is one. <laughs> You already have to deal with that. And then you have to deal with the energy of the land. All right. Yes. Energy of the land. Let me just share with you um, uh, a photo. Okay. A photo of uh, land that has been. Uh, <laughs> Is it scary? <laughs> the water energy. It's a water. Uh, it's also a water crystal by Imatu. Imatu Black. Imoto Masaru. <laughs> Imoto Masaru. Uh, test it was done by uh through this uh test as well this is the crystal of a place that in in switzerland that has been uh cleansed and revitalized by a chimac tau uh Jomanti, uh senior master okay let me just share with you this photo it is amazing because you can, you can, you see the land energy can also affect the water quality, right? The water vitality as well. That's why if you go to uh, places like in uh, Zam, Zam Zam in Makkah mm -hmm. or Lut, uh, mm -hmm. see that the water vitality are so much higher. The water quality is also better and you see beautiful crystals, okay? This is the crystal that was taken. Uh, well, this is this sample was uh, this crystal was from the sample that was taken from a house or a place in Switzerland that has been cleansed and revitalized by a Tao, a Chimek Tao Geomantis. <laughs> okay. All right, so I, just have, I just have to repeat that so that uh, you know we know what we're talking about. <laughs> okay, look at this. Wow, look at that. Wow, so beautiful. Wow, look at that. Wow. What do you think of that? That is the that represents the the land energy of wow. that place after being revitalized, after it has been cleansed. 
So mm -hmm. it has a higher energy, higher vitality energy in that area. That's why it affects the water. And this is the water crystal. Do you have a photo of um, the same water before? I, I can't find the picture of the crystal water. I yes. have this one that is after. Wow, it's but there is another one which is the rainbow color test. Okay, let's see. All right, can you see that? Yeah, and the before and after. This wow. one is before, and this is after. After a land healing, you call it the land healing or land revitalization. Yeah, this is how it looks like after, and this is before. All right. You see, before it is not bad. Actually, it's not bad. It looks nice. All right. But you can see that after it has been revitalized, it is enhanced. It is so much more than before. Yeah. The rainbow is everywhere. Yes. And it's amazing when you go there. I mean, if you're there, um, you can feel, you can really feel the difference before uh, the land is vitalized or cleansed. And after it has been vitalized or cleansed, you can really feel it. Um, if you are sensitive enough, you can feel it as well. Yeah. You know, your, your house can be uh, revitalized and cleansed as well. Uh, but you do have to get uh, people who know how to do this. Lah, all right. So in our group, AI Wellness, we are connected with a group of people that can do land healing and revitalization of the land. Not just land, also buildings. All right, you imagine this um, building when people build a house, all right? How many of them are really happy doing it? <laughs> I can, I can, I can imagine. You know, like, you knock the, the, up the, up the nails and then they were like, ha, ah, ah, beautiful day. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like that, right? They you are living in all the supervisors. <laughs> Killing me, blah, 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 blah. you know, they keep on anchoring it into the house. True. So the more they do, the more workers you have and a lot of fights, you know, that in construction sites, there's a lot of fights, there's a lot of arguments um, and this kind of things. And then there's a lot of aggressive things that they're cutting, you know, even this cutting energy is also very, uh, very aggressive. It's, it's not a very good uh, energy. All right. Mm -hmm. Um, so it, you want to feel how it, how aggressive it is there. I have this video of uh, of um, uh, of a factory in China. They cut through the uh, uh, they produce um, what's that rose quartz rose quartz crystals. Do you want to see? <laughs> I can imagine the the. Oh, I tell the you the way they cut. Oh my god! I feel like oh so aggressive. You know, mm, mm. <laughs> yeah, that's the reason why you really need to uh, reharmonize, reactivate uh, your crystals as well. Yes. Because there's a lot of, as you know, crystals have their own energy, but then it can get affected by energy around it. Yes, exactly. So, it so, it. Yeah, through this man, man made. Uh, uh, machineries, it can actually cause a lot of um, aggressiveness, you know? Yes. Yeah. That is, that I feel, is, I feel the difference. Yeah. You can feel the difference. That is why, um, for healing purpose, um, healing crystals purpose, it's always better to work with raw crystals that has gone minimal, um, minimal uh, process to uh, extract it out. Compared to, you know, like you can wear all those other stuff as well, you know, like those ha that has has been um, polished, uh, has been, you know, like um, gone through process of refinement. But as Cleo said, imagine the people who, who are doing works on them. Imagine the kind of um, mental state or emotional state <laughs> they were at the moment. Right. That's right. It's That's always right. better to go for the role. If you're yeah. using for the healing purpose, of course. But if only for what do you call that? Um, uh, aesthetic, you know, like as accessories. The best is always to get 
uh, those harmonized because at least those harmonized ones won't um, won't interfere with your uh, own um, physical your own body some frequency or your own body's aura right clear am it's I using not, right it's, here? It's not uh, it is less aggressive it is yeah. well harmonized so harmonized means to say it can harmonize with your own frequency in a much better and smoother way okay when it's aggressive you have your own en energy your crystal have your their own energy oh, and it's then fighting. It's fighting. <laughs> fighting so when it's harmonized it can you know it smoothly blind binds with your own frequency yeah. so exactly. it, that's it <laughs> Wow, okay. So I think we have spent the yeah almost two hours. All right. So okay, wow, Dion, very, very interesting sharing today. Yeah. So we thank uh <laughs> like you know. <laughs> yeah, because there's 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 a lot still. I think I think maybe we have um another session this time with Tracy because then she can go yeah. into the chemical um into the past where you and I cannot go into since our background doesn't allow us. <laughs> I mean, there is a limitation there because of our background, but I'm sure Tracy can delve further in more in depth because of her background. So Tracy, maybe, Tracy, um, Tracy has, uh, she has mentioned before that she will just believe that it works. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, um, hey, but, uh, also play a certain yeah. role I think. Yeah. yeah um actually naturally women are more um more sensitive uh you know yes. women are more sensitive so you can feel much more than men so women if you guys want to oh if you guys like if you ladies want to have uh you know uh some uh courses or some training sessions about how to feel the energy Okay, let us know. All right, you can contact yes. Dion yes. or contact me or any any one of my team in AEI Wellness. All right, we will be able to uh, connect with you, and then after that, we can arrange for um, classes. All right, classes on how to feel energy. All right, yeah, how to feel energy. That's a good idea, Cleo. We can have a ladies' night. <laughs> ladies' night too. Yeah. How to feel. Yeah. The, the best is when you're not sleepy, of course. <laughs> yeah, not sleepy. So, yeah, tomorrow morning we're gonna have uh tomorrow morning we're gonna have uh rainbow meditation. Uh, meditation, a rainbow meditation session at six o'clock in the morning upon request. So I'm waking up really early so that I can do the meditation. <laughs> rainbow <course> meditation. <laughs> do we have do we have to turn on the camera tomorrow or I can do it? Because uh, if you don't turn on the camera, then I cannot see what's happening. <laughs> You'll probably be sleeping. I'll be like, hello. hello. <laughs> because I was thinking like, okay, I can just do it while, you know, put in the um, the earphone and just lying down. <laughs> because it's like 6 a.m. I was like, oh. But then, okay. Um, yeah, it. I think 6 a.m. is quite, well, the day night is quite, um, but I think um, maybe for those that are new, maybe they can leave their camera on, but maybe yeah. I want to join, but I will have to turn uh -huh. off. My <laughs> it's good to turn on the camera so that I know what's happening because um, especially the first timer. The first timer, yes. The first timer. done this for like, a lot of time so <laughs> yeah, so we're I mean, doing this because um just to support those people that would like to have this okay so that's tomorrow that is actually um it's not in our official event uh, list um mm -hmm. let me just share with you uh, our next the rest of november yeah the rest of november um events we have next week we have talk um, we have uh, sharing, okay, sharing on Tuesday and also Thursday, every Tuesday and Thursday, we have sharing about how to, uh, how to maintain your um, skincare, okay, your skincare, um, 
as in how to care for your skin, all right? How to care for your skin, how to care for you, especially for your face, because or your face and your neck, because this is the part that you always, you know, open up to other people to see. I don't think you open up the rest of the body can. So, <laughs> but of course, you still have to care the rest of the body. All right. So every Tuesday and Thursday, next week, we're talking about high, uh, how to increase vitality and healthy skin cells on Tuesday. And then after that, on Thursday, why do we need masks? Okay. Why do we need to do a uh, facial mask? All right. There's a lot of masks. What's the breathing mask? What's the breathing mask? Okay. <laughs> Facial mask, all right? Why do you need it? And then on the 23rd of November and 25th of November, we're going to have uh, talk about, we're going to have sharing about wrinkles. How can you, uh, how, how can you help with your wrinkles? And which product can help you about wrinkles, all right? And then on every Wednesday, next week, uh, next Wednesday, and also the 20, next week, Wednesday, 17th, huh? And then on the 24th of uh, November, Wednesday, we're going to have tips sharing as well. Tips sharing, okay? More tips sharing. Today is exceptional because normally we arrange this for like one and a half hours. Tip sharing are more like uh, short, uh, it's only one hour. We're going to be sharing some tips, all right? <clears throat> and then on the 26th of November, Rainbow Baby. <laughs> We're going to have sharing about super baby. So, so, baby. <laughs> yeah, this is talking about tower of sex. All right. So basically how to create super baby or baby with higher soul age or baby that is super genius or, you know, smart babies when the moment they were born, they are super smart. Kind okay. of too big for us. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you are still, I mean, if you just got married or you're planning for a baby uh, soon, this is one of the talk that you would not want to miss. You would yes, want to exactly. sit there and follow the entire one and a half hours. <laughs> okay. And but of course, it's above 18, gun. 18 yes. and above. <laughs> And be prepared to have a fan to fan your face if 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 you're the blushy type, <laughs> because um, knowing knowing GM Lim, the top is going to be so um, <laughs> at a very least filtered. So <laughs> yes, and when I share on YouTube, of course it's gonna be eighteen and above, not for children. <laughs> okay so that is what's happening uh next week up to the end of the month and then we're gonna have uh sharing again in december so we'll announce it later on so here i would like to thank everyone on facebook for joining us and also those who are watching this uh this replay i, I hope you found that uh i hope you like what we shared today and uh, if there's anything, just uh, comment uh, in the comments below. And subscribe to our YouTube channel, AEI Wellness YouTube channel, all right, for more updates and sharing in future. And also here, I would like to thank Dion as well. Thank you very much for uh, being here with me, Dion, for this share. I am happy to be with you. And also, if you do have any more extra question, you can always reach out to Cleo or me. Yes. Uh, or you can just go do more reading and if you don't understand <laughs> just, <laughs> just get back <laughs> yeah, that's the thing but sometimes Google has uh, you know it can overwhelm you with a lot of information that exactly. you you are not able to apply mm -hmm. exactly. so we, maybe we can help you there so you can always connect with us if you need any help all right and uh, Dion, Dion is uh, specializing in crystals, crystallogy as well, and Loshu and crystallogy. So if mm -hmm. you need any readings to know about yourself, your, your soul, uh, what is your karma, karmic uh, direction, yeah. uh, crystallogy can be able, crystallogy and also Loshu astrology will be able to help you there as well. All right, so 
<clears throat> if you want to learn about law school reading, about law school astrology reading, you can also reach out to us. All right, yes. we have lots of things that we can, you know, share with you yeah. and also guide you uh, as long as you want to. All right. So, and, and, and also, uh, sorry to cut you, uh, Cleo. Uh, for, those, for those who have trouble with, um, not trouble, you know, like you want to help your kids better, especially those with growing, growing kids, right? Um, you might, you know, like in this age, I, I'm a mother, so I find it very, very challenging to try to connect with, with growing um, teenagers, especially. So I find that having the low shoe, uh, the low shoe reading and also Christology can help us to understand them better. Um, and it can also help us to guide them better. So in case you want to, you know, like these readings are not only for our own self, but we can only do it. I mean, we can also do it for our children so that in that way, we can actually find a way how to help them. You know, like especially children, they don't understand why they are the way they are or why they are feeling in certain way. So the Loshu reading and the Christology will be able to help um, us as the parents or as the mother to understand them better and we can help them. Yes, not only that, Dion, also for teachers, for teachers ah. that they would like to help their children, uh, their students, mm -hmm. um, Loshu Astrology will be, will be a very good tool for them yes. because uh, we also have a teacher, a tuition teacher that applies this law show astrology. She took this uh, course just to, so that she'll be able to help her students to mm -hmm. learn in a more effective manner. So exactly. um, yeah, so not only for parents, but also for teachers and also for human resources as well, if we extend it. <laughs> well. All right, mm -hmm. so how do, you, how do you do training need analysis? Um, actually, Loshu Astrology is a very good tool for you to, uh, for HR um, personnel to, um, to look into so that they can plan the training need analysis in a more effective manner as well. Which person need what kind of uh, trainings, you know? So yeah, yeah it, it, would, it would actually uh, supplement you in your work. All right. So yeah, so many things that we can share. Yes. Uh, okay. Yes. So uh, I think uh, until we'll end it here today. It's four o'clock. <laughs> nice. Four o'clock. And uh, we thank everyone for watching us today. Please yes. share the video with all your friends. All right. With all your friends so that they can get some awareness as well as some tips. Okay. For, for them in their life. Yeah. Dion, anything else? Yeah. Yes, nothing, nothing from me. So I think um, we had a very interesting session today. But of course, it barely, barely scratches the surface. This oh. topic actually goes um, down very, very deep and it covers a whole lot more. So what we did was just a scratch. That's it's true. less than 10%. It's just maybe 1% of what it can be. But it's a good start. So um, do follow do follow AEI um, Facebook group and also our YouTube channel and do tune in for all future uh, sharing or you can just go back and just look through all the past, yeah. all yeah. the recordings. And if you do I come up with want to anything, chat with yeah, anything that you're interested in, just reach out to any, of, to any one of us. Yeah. So um, I'm always here with Cleo. Uh, you know, like <laughs> yeah. a dangerous topic. <laughs> dangerous, yeah. topic. <laughs> dangerous, but yet interesting. You yes. know, <laughs> yes, dangerous but interesting. I mean, those dangerous topics are always the interesting ones because yeah. uh, a lot of people you know, don't want to touch them. <laughs> yeah, especially those that can help us, lah. Can help us, uh, you mm. know. To, to be better than, than before yes. or to be someone better, to be someone yes. better, right? So exactly. yeah. share with your friends, okay? All right, so I'll sign off now. We'll sign off now. We Bye. Thank, you. Thank, you. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.